We are at RuPaul's Drag Hunt. I'm with the icon, the legend, Laganja Estranja. How's it going, girl? Sickening, mama. How are you? Girl, I was kind of hoping you were going to do a death drop as you were walking down oh, the carpet earlier. No, 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 no. <laughs> not in this not in this couture, mama. How many times have you performed physical by Dua Lipa since oh All Star 6? <laughs> so honestly, I stopped counting yeah. after like the 150 mark. Yeah, right. But I think I'm around like 168 at this point. This country and our community yes. is feeling very attacked. Attack. Good okay. one. I see what you did there. You see what I'm doing, girl. You're especially being a beautiful trans woman that you you are. Sure. Do you have any positive affirmations or words of wisdom that you would want to share with our community right now? Yeah, I just, I mean, I, I feel like I'm living proof that if you are your authentic self and you always lead with kindness and love, that anything is possible. Oh, this? Oh, this? This is just the Dracon look. Just the Dracon, you know, butterflies, you know, <laughs> things like that. Vegas girls stick together. Oh my God, how are you doing? Thank you for having me. Girl, I'm so happy to have you because I got to tell you, ever since you were on the show, you came to Vegas right away mm -hmm. and you have not left your slang. I haven't. I like, you guys have like taken me in and I didn't want to leave because also the rent is the same as I used to pay. So I was like, great, <laughs> double the space and like the same rent in New York City, perfect. I'm a fan of yours, but I'm also a fan of your dad. I met him at Piranha. <laughs> you were there that night. Yes. My dad, Rick Dog, shout out. He uh, gets litty titty, okay? The House of Korkowski uh, throws down. I'm not the smartest girl, I will say that. We know, I'm kidding. Me neither, that's right. why we're sisters. Exactly, we see each other. We see each other. I'm not trade. I think you're trade, and I'm I think the fans would agree. I'm a little flaming clefable. You're a little this. I'm a lot of yeah. that. <laughs> I've had a House of Love cocktail, right? So I'm brave. We're ready for I'm it. brave, I can say what I want to say. Somebody else said Ahura and, um, and Sminty were kind of rude, but... Um, <laughs> Was there an excuse for that, or were they just straight up rude? I don't know if there was an excuse. They, they, they said they said they were dry. Well, now I gotta tell you, my friend. I remember when the season ended, um, the season that you were on, and I remember you sent out this iconic tweet saying, "I might not have won the competition, but I won the crowd." Oh, so you're a fan? Oh, I'm a fan. I've been a fan since day one. Oh, so Rich is a fan. Okay. The girls miss you. They fell in love with you, as we talked about, and they want to see you back on the TV screen. Uh -huh. So, is that a possibility? What do you think, girl? It absolutely is. I'm feeling definitely ready to get back on TV. I feel like I've completely grown and changed. I was like a queen of like two years right. when I was on my season, so now I've got five under me, and I feel like I've really figured a lot out, and I'm really ready to like go in and storm the girls and make some good TV. Princess Poppy. I love you, baby. I love her too. That troll look yesterday. I'm sorry I sent you home. <laughs> Are you really though? You're not sorry. I really am. I really am. Like I feel genuinely bad. <laughs> and I feel like I led to her spiral. Somebody suggested I do a podcast with my dad. Oh. He's here. Oh. Uh, Papa Fierce. <laughs> Papa Fierce, work in my booth. He's never been around this many queers before, so it's a culture shock for him. I'm the only one he knows. <laughs> <laughs> Especially in Connecticut. I mean, come on now. I mean, yeah, yeah, yeah. I, uh, Ray, who is your favorite RuPaul's Drag Race queen? Got Mick. She said that Got Mick is her favorite drag queen. Who is your favorite drag queen? Oh my God, you're putting me on the spot. I have to. Um, okay, well, listen, I've been watching Drag Race since it premiered in 2009, so there's been a lot through the door. But if I had to pick my end all be all, and it's because we have the same birthday, I would have to say RuPaul. Oh my God, well, that's the best choice. But if it were RuPaul, I, I do like Loritz Cheney. How funny is she? <laughs> Come on, RuPaul's Dracon. Let's get sickening, sickening. okay? <laughs>